Marvel Studio is about to introduce the next grand villain in the MCU storyline with Jonathan Major's performance as the Kang, which he will revisit in Ant-Man 3 after bringing the antagonist's first variant, He Who Remains, to life in 2021's Loki. And while he looks to live up to being the most powerful villain in the MCU history, even above Josh Brolin's Thanos, this take on the character will be much different from his comic counterpart in terms of powers and abilities. Looking at Kang in the comics, he doesn't actually have any true superpowers, instead using futuristic technology in his suit of armor. That suit allows him to produce conclusive blast out of his hands, although there are sure to be other powers that haven't been showcased on screen yet. But now, Jonathan Majors took the chance to dive deeper into his villain's powers, letting fans know what they should expect to see from the multiverse saga's ultimate antagonist. When he got asked where his superpower comes from, Major explained how his internal power is really the drive behind his character teasing that his pain suffering and discomfort are part of what makes the villain so great the internal friction is what makes kang so powerful with majors hyping him up by saying he lives up to that title of being the mcu's biggest villain ever Coming from the official press release for Ant-Man 3, director Peter Reed also spoke about how Kang has the ability to experience past, present and future all at once, making him one of the MCU's most calculated villain ever in terms of decision making. Jonathan Majors also spoke about Ant-Man 3 focusing on the relationship to time as human beings for each character mentioning that the three main themes in the story are love, friendship, and legacy. While fans have only gotten a small taste of Kang's power, more of which was shown in the trailer that exclusive premiered at the D23 Fan Expo, his real power seems to come from within. This continues a pregnant theme of MCU Big Bads, especially after Thanos revealed his own twisted motivation for wiping out half the universe. However, Kang's own struggles have the potential to be much more dangerous than anything the MCU has ever seen. So with that being said, we wrap our video here. If you have any questions regarding this video, feel free to ask in the comments below. And before leaving, don't forget to subscribe our channel. We'll see you in the next video. Take care. Bye-bye.